and here we come into the school and this is such a beautiful school such a beautiful where first of all here is the girls block and this is for kindergarten to ed and here it is such a beautiful ground here we can see that's all greenery right here and i really love this ground so much this is cool as a whole and as i mentioned the school is really big so i can't show you everything each and everything in the school but i'll be showing you the important things and particularly as i've said well even go in the library and the labs of this school so uh, now let's get going i just noticed here something very amazing so before going into the lab this is the tree house actually it isn't allowed to go there but still we can see just how beautiful this tree house is and how amazing the finishing and everything uh, everything has been done so it just shows that there's very much hard work put into the tree house and that's just shows that how beautiful this is actually so now let's get going and here we finally come this is the dp block and where there will uh, there are libraries labs and everything that i am just going to show you right now so let's now go yeah and here we enter the dp block first of all there is a poster this is live with values wow this just looks so amazing and here as we enter there are the rooms like stationery vip art room and there's the store room and as we go here's the canteen and then yeah finally here we are in the library so let me just enter and this is the library of eps and this is really such an amazing place since i am actually a book lover and i like to read books that much so that library is the place where actually we guys like to go so here's so you can find various genres that's language fiction non fiction and worth everything so there are just so many books in the library all around that you can see and this is the library of eps so as we now for now we have seen the library now we'll go to the physics lab and as we know that i'm a physics lover so physics lab it is just compulsory to show in this video without showing the physics lab the video can't be completed even so now let's go to the physics lab yeah and here we are in the labs first of all this is the chemistry lab of eps yeah so here it is the chemistry lab and as we can see there are various uh, kinds of uh, every kind of chemical and everything used for uh, chemistry experiments here's the biology lab right so as i am not particularly much into the field of biology so i'm not entering in the chemistry or biology lab but i will rather enter in the physics lab and that's right here but before we enter i'd like to have a few questions with uncle to pehle to uncle aapka kya naam hai okay and aap yahan kitne uh, saalon se hain 10 saal ho gaye 10 saal ho gaye and first of all uncle thanks a lot ki aapne mujhe right you uh, got me wandered around the campus and you had let me shoot this video so really thanks a lot and aapko is school mein kaisa lagta hai acha lagta hai yeah so that's the thing and now let's enter in the physics lab of eps and here we go this is the physics lab and this thing is just really amazing and here we are here we can find various instruments and everything that are used for physics experiments particularly right so there are uh, there are just ammeters galvanometers voltmeters and everything सिंस मोस्ट फिजिक्स एक्सपेरिमेंट्स में जो भी डिवाइस होते हैं दीज आर इलेक्ट्रिकल यू कैंट फाइंड दो मैनी एक्सपेरिमेंट्स इन अदर एरियाज ऑफ फिजिक्स बट इलेक्ट्रिकल यू नो इन इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिज इन दर सो मेनी इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स एंड एक्सपेरिमेंट्स एंड हेयर ही इज ऑब्वियसली दैट देर इज नो फिजिक्स लैब ऑफ प्लेस फॉर फिजिक्स वेर देर इज इन सर एल्बर्ट आइंस्टाइन एंड देर ही इज एल्बर्ट आइंस्टाइन यू कैंट एक्सप्लेन इज सिंपली यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड इट वेल इनफ या दैट्स ट्रू that if we are not able to explain any certain topic clearly to somebody in front of us and that means we aren't clear at the topic by ourselves and the only way to clear even the topic is to explain it to someone to practice more and more and that's the thing so this is really the physics lab of eps such an amazing place there it is and here are i guess yeah our band codes Oh, resistors, I guess, and everything. The electromagnetic spectrum. Here's the electromagnetic spectrum, and everything. So this is the 
physics lab of EPS as I wanted to show since EPS is really a so large school but and that is the reason that I can't show you all the blocks and everything I can't uh, go in all the classrooms and show you everything so that is really a kind of difficult task to do it in a short video and I guess impossible to do it really in a short video it would require an hour long video or even perhaps more than that that is the reason I'm just showing you the main things that is the library and I've shown you the physics lab that is all that I actually wanted to show you in this video particularly now you might be wondering that why am I even at EPS well I'm at EPS First of all, I'd like to tell you that EPS, it is the world's lowest fee IB world school and that makes this place such an amazing place, such an amazing school that in just so low amount of fee, they are providing us world class education, world class facilities, there are world class libraries, world class labs and everything in just so low amount of price. So this isn't just a school instead, this is just a social reform, that is the thing, to improve the modern generations, to get them into science and everything, to educate them, not just taking fee as most of the schools are doing. Like if you look over, nowadays the schooling and education has just become a business, but this isn't a place like that, like those businessmen make, but instead the founder here he hasn't done any of these things by money but rather he has done it for education educating the next generation that is one reason i like eps so much and you a few of you might be wondering that what is ib so let me tell you that ib also called international baccalaureate actually ib is the world's best schooling program if we talk about IB, most of the intake of students in the world's top class universities like Ivy League also called. So that is from IB schooling program. So if you want to go in world's uh, top class, you know, uh, universities as I want to do like you can call it MIT, Stanford, Harvard or Cambridge. So IB board will be best suitable for us and also I'd like to mention that as I've talked about world's top class universities and colleges that includes the Cambridge this school has been affiliated from the Cambridge International School and that is the one re one of the so many reasons that I like this place so much and here as we see that's the way to swimming pool as it says so the swimming pool is in there and that is uh, so I like I really love this school so much and it's from IV schooling program and so there are so many things that I actually want to talk in this video but it can't be completed but uh, if I want to inform few other things like IB and EPS its mission is not just to educate the kids educate our next generation the students by their academic studies the things that they learn from textbooks but rather IB and as well as EPS they develop research skills in students communication skills social skills critical thinking skills their uh, analytical skills and that is the thing that this makes this place so um so such an amazing school such an amazing place and that is such an amazing schooling program and even EPS since it isn't just doing business like other schools instead it wants to create a better generation better next generation modern generation that is the reason that eps has actually offered me to teach in free all the ib education and they are even giving me a place to live here as residential so and plus they will also give me stipend uh, for which will be saved and used for my uh, studies in the later on universities after my intermediate from her after the IB diploma program as if I want to go a place like MIT or Stanford or Harvard I actually want to go to the Trinity College Cambridge so this stipend can be used later on for that reason and so I have decided just now that I will enter I'll take my admission in grade 8 in EPS and will continue my studies later on studies from EPS and that will be really such an amazing experience and as EPS you can call it just like my dream school so it's really an amazing place and as I've been mentioning I can't show you the entire area it's a really vast area but 
these were the few things that i had to show you and tell you about in this short video here we are so this is as you can read there eps eastern public school education ethics and enterprise so there's the office meeting room and there's the reception and here's the recording studio even and as you can read that this is something that i really like to show you it's very important awarded number one international school in bhopal as you can read right there it's really the number one international school in bhopal such an amazing school so uh, since this video uh, it has to be short actually so that is the reason i'd like to end this video right at this point but again i will just say it is an amazing school and i would really i'm looking forward to studying in eps for my later on studies from grade 8 to continuing uh, until further till i go in other universities like trinity college cambridge as i want to go as we can see as the office as the meeting room chairman was the founder of this school and the head of school that's the resource room and that is the thing that is all i wanted to show and that was all for today and thanks to you always